Hi, I'm Andy, and today I'm counting down my top five epic fails. You see, on my adventures, things haven't always gone to plan. Now, I've been lucky enough, or unlucky enough, to slide down things, fall into things, been flung off things, snotted on by angry dinos, shared a mud bath with a woolly mammoth. But most of all, I found myself tumbling through the air. Because, of course, what goes up must come down. Well, as you can see, there are so many mishaps to pick from. But coming in at number five, it's Kip's brilliantly bouncing helping hopper fail. I was about to go on a wild adventure to see lemurs in Madagascar. But first, I had to pop to the workshop to test out Kip's latest invention. What's this you making? This is my brilliantly bouncing helping hopper. Go on, put your helmet on. All right. OK. Now, uh, press that button. Right. And stand on it. Travel back in time now for number four, as I give you the prehistoric hornet nest fail. On an adventure 30 million years ago, I was caught in a rainstorm and needed to get dry. I'll just shake this off. Oops. Uh-oh. I've just disturbed a hornet's nest. And they look pretty angry. Oh, oh get out! Get out of it! Sim We're off to Bangladesh for number three. It's the Asian elephant inflatable boat fail. I was on an adventure rescuing Asian elephants from flood water when suddenly... <gasps> completely stuck. <laughs> Maybe the elephants can give me a hand. <laughs> or a trunk. Here it goes. <laughs> oh, that's it, big buddy. Go on. We're off to Ethiopia for number two. It's the Vulture Bone Fail. On an adventure to Ethiopia, I needed to get back to the safari mobile and fast to the rescue, a hungry vulture. Dinner is served. Um, I haven't really thought this through. How am I going to get... <laughs> A prehistoric predicament now as I proudly present my number one epic fail. I give you... The Pterosaur Balloon Fail. <laughs> On an adventure with some Diplodocus, ooh, ooh, ooh. I found myself stuck up a tree. <laughs> oh. Oh. No, don't go. I know, my backpack. It's always full of useful things. Right. Well, it is a rope, but it's attached to a rescue balloon. It's working. Here we go. of pterosaurs, and they're coming this way. Oh. Hang on. They're going to pop the balloon. But shoo! Shoo! Oh. Oh. 
Oh, well, you have to admit, I do get myself into some pretty unusual scrapes, but I have a lot of fun doing it. So, there we have it. My top five epic fails. See you next time.